Welcome to or welcome back to my channel, Alicia Influencer. I'm Alicia Victoria and this is Black Girl Chats where I just chat and share insights for life upgraded. So in today's episode, episode 26, I'm keeping it short, sweet, and simple. I'm hitting you with the three bullet points, that three-point presentation, the meat and potatoes of the matter. And if you use dental floss picks, you definitely would use them for the meat and potatoes. So I'm giving you the low, medium, high price point, value range, and best value for using dental floss picks. If you use them, then you already know. Basically, if you know, you know. So let's get right into it. Why don't we start from the top, then go on down? I know people like to say, hey, if you start from the bottom, you can only go up from there. But let's start with the Rolls Royce, the Rolls Royce of dental picks and see where the gold standard kind of is. Now, I'm not saying that this is the best floss pick in the world and the most luxurious one and the most expensive one, but given my experiences and given the people's experiences, check your Amazon reviews, your Target reviews, your Walmart reviews, the people's choice, the long standing victor is Oral B, okay? Oral B has had the game on lock for floss picks for a while. But before we get into that, starting with the high floss pick and the high standard, what we're not going to do, what I'm going to share up front, we're not going to share about everything else that is not a floss pick. Now, there may be some that have their, um, Floss, string floss, their water flossers, their is it called interdental picks, all of those things. And they may be wonderful and great for adding value to the conversation and even your own personal dental routine. But for this video, we're focusing on floss picks alone. Now, if you want to recommend something like that in the comments, feel free to do so. But for those who want the information about floss picks, best value. And as mentioned, getting to the point, the meat and the potatoes, and your floss pick to help you with it, let's go. So Oral-B Glide Floss Picks. And what I did after using them and really liking them is I started moving to the value pack. And that's what I use for years. So, excuse me, they have the Arctic Peppermint Oil, which is an intense Blast of freshness. It's one of the stronger flavors. So if you like a strong flavor with your floss pick, they went on that 10 out of 10. They're one of the strongest flavored um, floss picks that I've used um, to this day. So if you like a very fresh minty aftertaste and mouthfeel, then I recommend them for that. They also boast, this is what they say about themselves, that their floss pick slides up to 50% easier, that they gently clean and just below the gum line, and of course they have that refreshing clean blast of Arctic peppermint oil. And so they're saying experience the glide difference and they can boast and back their product and even have a satisfaction guarantee. So what I got was the value pack, which helped to save some moolah moolah, and it's 150 mint floss picks. The reason I like this out of a number of picks I had tried up to that point was because that it was very gentle, the gentleness was key, the refreshing mint aftertaste, that clean fresh breath feeling, especially between meals, especially getting in between the gums and gum lines after eating and drinking and having a little mint refresher without having to actually use a whole mint or a Listerine strip or mouthwash and you know getting that complete um, minty mouth flavor. You know if you just want a hint of it given a spark of fresh breath for that without having to have okay I felt like I just gargled with mouthwash for 30 seconds then I recommend that also I really liked it because it was very smooth the floss it did not feel like string floss it felt like floss tape and it makes for a very as the name suggests easy gliding experience 
excuse me, so those with sensitive teeth or, you know, bleeding gums or sensitivity in the mouth or you just don't want to be pulling and you may have tighter space between your teeth, this is the type of pick that really reaches and gets the job done. Also, it has its a dental pick on the end and you know it's kind of rounded it's it's not the best I would say but it's durable it's not gonna snap and break on you the whole floss pick is not going to snap and break on you and it's what I would recommend if you want to shell out the bucks on your floss picks for me I typically found the product starting at six dollars and up and it can go towards ten dollars or more even with the value packs depending on how many you are getting and for floss picks you know that's a little bit of an investment so that's why i put them at the high the top tier level but in terms of performance quality durability doing what it says it's going to do i highly recommend it but is it the best value and bang for your buck in need, I would say continue listening. Now, for floss pick number two, stepping into the arena, coming into the show, it is Plackers, okay? Initially, I found the Plackers brand in the Dollar Tree, and I got it, you know, dollar, dollar twenty-five, and it was not that impressive. I wasn't impressed. I said, okay, I will just throw these in my travel kit, my carry-on types of bags, and use it as a backup. Basically, it's not worth it. It's not helpful for day-to-day, -day, but in an emergency for travel, it'll work in a pinch. It will make do. So I had kind of moved along from placards, but then your girl, your girl felt like, oh no, quote, I'm getting tired tired and quote of paying so much for the oral b name brand gentle slide arctic fresh breath essential oil floss picks and so i wanted other options i like saving a little bit for the value pack but it was still a bit much to me for floss picks especially when you're buying these name brand toothpaste excuse me you're buying these name brand toothpaste you're buying these name brand hip trendy electric toothbrushes you're getting whole water floss pick systems and the dental routine costs are increasing increasing like a 15 step korean skincare routine okay you want to save the money where you can but you actually want to get the effectiveness and value so Placards was a no for me. I had moved along until I saw highly reviewed and rated on Amazon Placards Gentle Slide. Now, the one I had gotten from the Dollar Tree were like the green and blue placards, the standard entry level baseline of their product, which could be expected in the Dollar Tree. No offense, no shade. But with this Placards Gentle Slide on Amazon, this seemed to be more of their mid entry or even higher end level of their dental floss product. I feel like I'm talking about cars now at this point. Well, this was getting into the add-ons higher end level of their brand, okay? This was the coupe or coupe of their car line, but we're talking floss picks, remember. So I looked at it, I said, hmm, I needed to add on for my Amazon cart. Again, if you know, you know, you know, you need a certain amount to get that free shipping if you're not Prime, but sometimes even with Prime, you know, just rounding your cart out. So I needed an add-on item that wasn't going to be over $5. I didn't want it over $3. In fact, I wanted it around $1. And when I caught this special, it was around that price point for what I recall. But then when I went to order it later on, I think it was close to three to four dollars on my side. What your Amazon shows may be different, but it should be around three to four dollars. Again, it was highly reviewed, it had great ratings, it seemed like an Oral B competitor, and Plackers is a well known brand too. Maybe just not at the Colgate Crest Oral B level in the dental health care. Basically, they're not going to be what your dentist is giving you in that little friendly to go package like Crest, Colgate, Oral B but they're in the dental name game. So I tried it and let me tell you, let me tell you, this has become one of my top favorites even over Oral-B. The price point, under $4. The design of the item, this is where it beats Oral-B Glide to me. It has a unique ergonomic 
handle design and it makes it very easy and comfortable to floss. Again, for a person who may have tighter spaces between their teeth, it is excellent, especially for reaching towards the back and not having to go get string floss and really struggle or get the water pick flosser out every time, especially that would be inconvenient for one on the go. So this gets to the back, it helps clean the teeth, it gets to the gum line and gets out debris, but it doesn't have to be a hassle, a struggle, and or inconvenient. It also has the toothpick in to remove trapped food debris. So again, it's great for getting that, but also getting towards the back of the teeth again. And for those who have, you know, wider spaces in their teeth, it's great as well because it has the soft tape floss like Oral-B Glide. And that makes a big difference using the tape floss versus the string. But Again, when you're using the soft tape floss, this is what you want to look for. One that doesn't shred easily, one that doesn't break easily. Now the Oral-B said they were engineered to do so. So you know I'm expecting the same level, if not better, from Plackers if they're repping the soft tape floss too. And they delivered. It gently slides smoothly between tight spaces and the teeth smoothly and getting out dirt and debris and it can be used multiple times you know I like to wipe mine between um, using the floss pick but it doesn't just tear up stretch out bend shred easily you get the full I would say pick use before actually having to throw it out and usually one pick is enough to get the job done between eating so with the affordable price point the Features that the Oral-B Glide has that is comparable and in some areas a little better, like I like their toothpick and floss pick a little better, and that it's so gentle, especially for those who have sensitive teeth, receding gums, are needing to use floss picks more regularly or more frequently, maybe due to plaque, gingivitis, or whatever reason, and you just, you know, want an overall easier experience, not feeling like you're in pain from using a string cheaper or not as thoughtfully designed floss pick, then the Plackers Gentle Slide is something that you should look into. And while they are not having the uh, guarantee, like the Oral-B, the satisfaction guarantee, they do, you know, if you get them from your local retailer or maybe an Amazon, you can return them if you're not satisfied with the product. But I think this will be a product that you particularly like. And lastly, as a bonus feature, on the top part of the floss pick, they actually have these cool ridges that help you grip and maneuver it even better. So going back to that car analogy and it being the top of the line of the car um, brand, I feel that's that added feature, that added feature that just takes it to the next level. So that grip, like a good steering wheel, that grip really helps in uh, having control and maneuver maneuverability let's say it all together class maneuverability with the floss pick and really being able to work and use it between your teeth tight spaces and in regards to the gum line without doing damage without straining your hand or you know feeling any discomfort and it's an A1 to me. It's great for the zigzag motion, it's great for removing food, and it's able to be used repeatedly until the floss pick is done, which as I said, usually can last for one mouth session. Hey, that's a nice way to word it. Now, starting from the bottom, we can only go up from here because you all have already heard my high and medium choices. It's actually back to old Dollar Tree, now Dollar Tree Plus. And they have a product, a trend product, a product that you would more so find on Instagram, someone's social media brand from an Instagram founder, um, like a hip dental brand, like these newer ones, like Moon, Quip, etc. This is the type of brand that is now in the Dollar Tree Plus, and it is called Grin, okay? And what they boast about Grin is that, oh, I'll let you hear what they say about themselves. They say, what's great about Grin? Well, their emphasis is that they are made with, re with recycled plastic. So Grin is coming out and they are standing strong on the green industry, you know, people liking more natural healthcare, mindful types of items, 
earth loving items as they call themselves, climate change friendly items, and they're made with recycled plastic. So Grin gets what the times are about. They've got their hashtag on their packaging. It looks very trendy. It looks like it's ready for some influencer's photo. And they've got hashtag smile with a purpose, but do they work? Now with Grin, they get the first point right. They don't go with that string floss or that thinner floss. They use floss tape. So it gently slides between the teeth. Okay. Then in moving with the soft life, softer generations is what I would call them. They don't give an end toothpick or a pick at the end of the flosser. They have it as a safe fold back pick. You know, like those safe playgrounds they have for kids now these days. They have a safe fold back pen so you know you're protected when you use the product and you don't accidentally prick yourself. Thoughtful, you decide. Then with their floss, the other standout feature I would say for the product is that they use longer floss. Now this is a difference between the Oral-B and the Plackers Gentle Slide. Again, Gentle Slide, not just any Plackers in particular. The Grin brand has longer floss that wraps around the tooth for a spool floss like clean so it gives you that string floss maneuverability the word of the day and it really cleans the teeth like you're flossing with the longer string floss individually throughout designed in the u.s and the price point like on target shows on my end for about three dollars or so but as I mentioned, it's in the Dollar Tree Plus now, so it's a dollar twenty-five, making it the most affordable of all three. Now, in terms of performance, does it actually work? I'm not trying to say what I'm trying to say, but what I'm about to say that I'm trying to say. But sometimes products go to the Dollar Tree from the main retailers for a reason. This is actually, performance-wise, not that highly rated. It gets about a two out of five consistently. It's not even getting into the average. It has the features. It has the boasts. It's designed in the U.S. It's got the trends. It is earth-loving, okay? It's a thoughtful, mindful, earth-loving toothpick. But sometimes with those natural, holistic, <coughs> earth-loving, mindful products, if you know that you know, then you know what I'm about to say. Sometimes they don't meet the grade of their competitors, mainstream, long-standing industry performing counterparts. And so what I will say is that Grin for me goes into that category of Dollar Tree placards. It's great for an emergency, for a backup, if you want to have something on hand in case your value pack runs out before you thought it would, in case you know you spill your bag out and you're like, oh, my floss picks fell on the floor. I need something. You know, I got to get this debris, food debris out my teeth. Use it for that, for travel, on the go. If you're sharing a floss pick with someone, not literally, but like, hey, hey girl, you got any floss picks, toothpicks, floss? Girl, grin, I got you pass a couple of those from the bags. That's the type of situations you would use Grin for, in my opinion. And when you want to care about the earth more, maybe on Earth Day, you're like, hey, I'm going to choose Grin. But for everyday needs, performance, durability, getting the job done, mm, it's a no for me. Okay, it's a no for me. Again, I like the trendy packaging. For $1.25, it's better than maybe a number of the other ones offered in the Dollar Tree. So it is the higher end better choice if you're choosing amongst the ones in the Dollar Tree, in my opinion. But if it's standing against um, Oral-B and Gentle, uh, Plackers Gentle Slide, excuse me, then no. So in sum, because this video actually got longer, so thank you for staying to the end and for your patience. And I hope this information has been helpful. Like a lot of things, it is not the black and white, it's actually in the gray. It is in the average, in the middleman that the winner shines forth and comes through, that they just have that reliability and they are the safe choice. So if you're looking for the best value and if you're looking for the uh, recommended floss pick from my end from years of floss pick use and different types of floss picks, then I suggest. For the winner, the Plackers Gentle Slide 
floss picks. Again, the Plackers Gentle Slide Floss Floss Picks. And for the one I got on Amazon, it is the 90 count. They last a long time because when they get the job done and get the job done well, sometimes you don't need to have a pack of 200. You know, you get a lot of use out of one. Um, and so I will leave it at that. I will leave the links in the description box. And again, thank you for sticking with me to the end. That's all for now. If this chat's helped add value to your day, then hit that like button and don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Stay posted, stay blessed.